But one thing I want to add about Xero and these programs that are really, really good is that, so what happens is you have your bank account here and you have your program here and they link up. So every, every time you tap your card, every time you pay an invoice, um, wages, superannuation, if you have staff members, it links up. So you go into that program and you do your bank reconciliation and then you click, yes, that's wages. That was my last product. Um, this was my rent. I took money out of the bank. You know, it, it matches all up. So then you get your yep. profit and loss. You get your balance. That's right. Everything, like, and it makes it easier for your accountant and it gives you a track so you'll know what you're starting to make. That's right. Everything like yeah, that. couldn't agree more. And well summed up, Jess. It gives you, it gives you real-time data too. Yeah. Um, so you can look at your... You've done all your reconciliations you can look at what your profit and loss is to right now um, yeah. so it's important to track those things look at your cash flow cash flow is critical in a business mm -hmm. um, so whatever that software is you choose it becomes your hub you know you do your invoicing from it you yeah. do payroll if you've got staff you yeah. can automatically pay your superannuation um, yeah. yeah absolutely important to make sure you pay your staff super yeah, um, it's nine and a half percent nine and a half percent yeah of ordinary time earnings um, yeah. And if you pay them less than four hundred and fifty dollars a month, you don't have to pay it. That's that's an exemption. Yeah. Um, and that that program works it all out for you. It, it does. tells you what to do. Yep. So that's yeah, critically important that you yeah. you pay the super, which is automated um, if you've got the right subscription through Zero or QuickBooks, mm -hmm. um, and you pay that PAY entitling on staff as well. So not something that you'll do straight away as a, as a startup, but um, it's something that you'd be working. Yeah, towards. consider consider it. Um, very important because those are the things no matter what structure you have you can be personally liable for so yeah um, yeah very very important and um, yeah like I said we recommend zero um, QuickBooks is a good alternative but anything cloud-based we would um, generally be quite happy with but zero, yeah. zero, zero is, is the one zero is the best like I said I've used um, you know QuickBooks I absolutely hated it I just found zero much much easier and I've used it as a sole trader a company and then a company with a trust in it yep. like it makes no difference what your sole trading company or anything like that it's it's user friendly for everything yep so um yeah thanks for watching everyone and yep. um hope you've really enjoyed and got some inf valuable information out of the, the video